what is going on YouTube it's a boy Billy Kibaki and in today's video I'll be showing you how to install HAN on your PS3 using the new hybrid firmware 4.84.1 now this will work on any model PS3 any type of PS3 doesn't matter if it's fat slim or whatever it will still work on your PS3 you will need to update your PS3 using the new hybrid firmware um, all the links will be in the description so make sure that you guys read through the description and follow the instructions here alright so let's go ahead and get started so right here I have some tools that I'll be using I'll be using the mini web because it's a lot faster um, you don't need to do anything to the mini web I went ahead and config the mini web for you guys right here I have the HFW the hybrid firmware 4.84.1 um, you will need to rename this I'll show you guys how to do that and you will need the release files to put on your USB stick alright so what we need to do first is go ahead and get your USB stick this is mine right here so this is my USB stick make sure that your USB stick is formatted to FAT32 you want to go ahead and copy the firmware paste it on your USB stick okay so once the update has been placed on your USB stick you want to go ahead and create a new folder and you want to call this one PS3 drag the update inside that folder go inside the PS3 folder and create another folder called update now drag the update inside that folder go inside the folder and you just want to rename this file make sure that you guys rename it the exact same way and that's it now we can go back and that's it now go to the PS3 tool right here and you want to just open it open this folder and you want to drag the hand support files 4.84 drag it and drop it right here we can now close this folder down extract the uh, hand support files go right here copy all these files and paste them on your USB stick okay so now we can eject the USB stick go back out all right so let's head over to the PS3 now okay so now that we're on the PS3 um, go ahead and plug the USB stick in the right USB port and as you guys can see there's nothing on my PS3 let me go over and show you my firmware my firmware is 4.84 if you are on 4.83 this will update the PS3 to 4.84.1 alright so just press circle go all the way up to system update um, update via storage and there you go 4.84.1 HFW hybrid and exploitable just go ahead and press OK this will install the hybrid firmware on your PS3 okay guys so the PS3 has just rebooted so we have just um, installed the hybrid 4.84 one on the PS3 so if I go over back to system settings system information you're gonna still see the same um, version that you had before or your version will look like this but it doesn't matter 
okay so just press circle and go all the way back over here now go down to internet browser press X when you get to this part you want to press triangle go to tools go to home page and you want to use a blank page okay exit the browser and then enter the browser again so press X and enter the browser one more time okay so you should have a blank page as your own screen right now so let's head over back to the PS to the PC for the mini web and right here is the mini web as I mentioned before I config the mini web for you guys so you don't have to do anything to it so just open it and you want to right click and go to properties and make sure that you run this as administrator okay also please turn off your firewall or your antivirus or anything that you may have blocking the mini web okay so go ahead right click and open and as you guys can see right here we have an host IP address right here so this is the one that we need to enter in the PS3 browser so let's head back over to the PS3 and what you want to do is press start you want to delete this and you want to enter the host IP address that we just saw so one nine that's it press start on the controller and it should bring you right here so let's should bring you right here so as you can see at the top it says act IDPS dumper the bottom one says act riff copier the other one says debug package enabler hand enabler and hand installer what we're gonna do is go to hand installer right here so make sure that your USB stick is plugged into the right USB port and press X press X again and just go ahead and click initialize hand installer and there you go we get hand installer initialized successfully go ahead and launch hand installation ps3 will reboot okay guys so the ps3 has just rebooted and as you can see we now have our package manager right here we have everything right here so we can now continue using our hand exploited ps3 um so guys let me know if you want to see a part two of this video i will gladly make one for you guys and as you can see there is my firmware 4.84 hybrid so simple as that guys as i said if you guys want to see me make a part two video let me know in the comments below you can also go back to internet browser make sure that the mini web is still running on your computer press start go back to the same IP address again and then you can click um, hand enable right here from right here you can go ahead and enable hand there you go hand enable and that's it now we can go ahead and install our pkg files and all of that so guys if this video was helpful please give it a like and also share the video around and also you guys can subscribe for more video to come thank you for watching and i will see you guys in my next video